This, ladies and gentlemen, is the Sandiverse. And the rabbit hole goes deeper than you could ever imagine. Everything on this wall is connected. Go! And we're gonna start with 51st Dates. Dan Aykroyd in this movie plays a doctor in Hawaii. We are funded out of Sandusky, Ohio by T.B. Callahan, the automotive components type. Back in Sandusky, Ohio, there are 300 American workers at Callahan Auto. We make the best parts money can buy. Therefore, connecting 51st Dates to the Tommy Boy universe. In the same scene, Dan Aykroyd introduces us to 10 Second Tom. Hi, I'm Tom. Huh? Uh, Henry. Hi. Marlon. Tom lost part of his brain in a hunting accident. His memory only lasts 10 seconds. 10 Isn't Second Tom also appears in Blended. Hi, I'm Tom. Here's your change. Hi, I'm Tom. And what's Dan Aykroyd's name in 51st Dates? Dr. Keats. Where do I know that name from? You're a piece of shit. You know that, Keats. Ha! Damon Wayne's character in Bulletproof was named Rock Keats. 51st Dates and Blended are both connected to Happy Gilmore. Oh, Doing the bullpens. Feeling the floor. Working it. Working it. What's the caddy's name? I don't know. I don't know. You find out in Jack and Jill. And then your dad and I went to the soup kitchen and they gave us Otto to bring to Thanksgiving dinner this year. Thanks again for having me. In Happy Gilmore, Chubbs Peterson falls out of a window and dies. In Little Nicky, he's in heaven, no longer a golf pro, however. Pro, but up here, he's just the dopest dance instructor. And who else is in Little Nicky? You can do it, Nicky! But we first meet the townie in The Water Boy. You can do it! Farmer Fran also has his first appearance in The Water Boy. Me tug dog, yeah. And later, a cameo in Joe Dirt. Now, nah, how me way, mate. Going back to the You Can Do It section of the Sandiverse, we go to the animal in the corner of Schneid. Since Rob Schneider is the lead, Adam Sandler fills in for the role of the townie. You can do it! This is not the only time Adam Sandler has covered for a Rob Schneider role. Now I know what you're saying. Sean, the corner of Schneid has nothing to do with Adam Sandler. Yes, it does! Because they're Happy Madison Productions, and I had to watch all of those, too! That's a huge bitch can be seen in Deuce Bigelow 1. That's a huge Deuce Bigelow 2. That's a huge bitch. The hot chick. That's a huge bitch. And the animal. That's a huge bitch. Also, the hot chick is connected to Saturday Night Live. Once again, Adam Sandler steps in for a Rob Schneider role. Yes, but you can put your weed in there. Really? Yeah. And you put your weed in here. <laughs> we go back to the You Can Do It first. Rob Schneider, he's in prison. You can do it. In the longest yard, Adam Sandler gets arrested by two cops. One of the cops being none other than sportscaster Dan Patrick, who seemingly plays the same cop in I Now Pronounce You Chuck and Larry. How are you going to get from I Now Pronounce You Chuck and Larry to Billy Madison? It's through a little kid's book. The Puppy Who Lost His Way by Chrissy Taylor. The lunch lady connects Come on. Billy Madison, Saturday Night Live, and his first album. <laughs> On his second album is a song called Dick Doodle. You know they're coming straight from the heart. Never make fun of your grandma. Even when she rips a juicy fart. <laughs> Third album, Red Hooded Sweatshirt. First appearance, Weekend Update. <laughs> dip, dip, dip. <laughs> Master of Disguise is connected to Saturday Night Live. I like it, the juice. You like it, the juice? You like it, the juice, eh? <laughs> they share the same mother. That may be a little lady. You play with your cock and balls for mama. I don't think so. Just go play with your cock and balls. Right away, mom. These two share the same talking goat. I am a simple goat. Hey, goat, how's it going? Huh? It's dark. I cannot see you. Come closer. Still in the goat sketch. How do they connect? A simple character name of Garaputo. Except this one fat shit, uh, Garaputo. Oh, you know, I know what I'm that, talking yeah. about? And I'll introduce you to Mr. Garaputo, the mall manager. That sketch titled Whitey is our introduction to the old man in Eight Crazy Nights. Yeah, my name's Jerry, by the way. I see you from your name tag. My oh. name's Whitey. It's me, Whitey Duval. The legend of psychotic Uncle Donnie is the birth of Donnie Burger, and that's my boy. All right, you fucking lightweight. So you're gonna water ski or you're gonna slide your fucking tampons in? Fucking you guys got your face covered in leprechaun shit. We should be getting whacked off, all of us, as a fucking team! Donnie, I think... Donnie's son enough. is getting married. Oh, Who's the minister? What about Father Shockley? Oh, stupid bird. Father Shockaloo wants Dr. Shockaloo <laughs> from Grandma's boy. Dr. Shockaloo gets it. Yeah, he does. 
These two don't connect to the main verse, but they do connect to each other. The, building, the delivery guy in Big Daddy has a little tiny cameo oh, in Mr. It's Deeds. It's How about that? That brings us back to Billy Madison. Billy Madison connects the click through one family name. O'Doyle oh, oh, rules. O'Doyle oh, rules. Sean, the O'Doyle family tree was wiped out in that car crash. Wrong! There is next door neighbors in click. Ha 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 ha! You're making a Derek G to yourself, O'Doyle. In click, there's a running joke that a dog keeps screwing at a stuffed duck. Now that same stuffed duck shows up in funny people in clips for a fake movie called The Redo. A deleted scene in Click was the last known you can do it until December 2015 when Real Rob premiered on Netflix. You can do it. You can do it. <laughs> Don't forget about Rudy Giuliani. You can do it, David! Back to Click and my golden star, Lamonsoff. In 2017, in the movie Click. Great news. Eric Lamonsoff killed himself. <laughs> Something about that name, Lamonsoff. Where is it from? Where is it from? Ludlow Lamonsoff, the Wonder Kid? Oh, that's not it. But I guarantee he's related to Eric Lamonsoff and how the rest of the Sandlerverse is going. Hey now. <laughs> Lamonsoff. Oh, it's Kevin James in Grown Ups. That's his exact character name. Was that spelled with an O? Well, that's dumb. Point is, Eric Lamonsoff dies in 2017. So no more Grown Ups movies. But that's still not what I'm looking for. We were first introduced to Eric Lamonsoff in 1985. Hey, I know for a fact you gave Eric Lamonsoff that price. It may be a bit of a stretch, but I believe that John Lovett's character Jimmy Moore in The Wedding Singer 15 years later became the perv in the tree in Little Nicky. Think about it. They're both perverts. They both spy on people. And the same song plays every time they're on screen. Woo! Yes, it's lady. Ladies night and the feet. Ooh, showtime. So, have you found the one film on this wall that I haven't talked about yet? That's right. It's Adam Sandler's 9-11 drama, Rain Over Me. And would you believe that it's connected to these other five films? And we're gonna start with The Water Boy and Adam Sandler's unhealthy obsession with Kentucky Fried Chicken. Mama's wrong again. <laughs> no, Colonel Sanders, you're wrong. Colonel Sanders been eating his own chicken. <laughs> you got a better chance getting Colonel Sanders interested in a hamburger, buddy. Yeah, but those guys had a skill that you never mastered. They knew how to pass the ball. Oh. <laughs> Looks like somebody has to learn how to pass the Kentucky Fried Chicken. Repeto do bato. Oh, my God. Is that Colonel Sanders? Hi. Hey. Did you see it? Hi. Hi. There it is, kids! The 2016 Sandlerverse. It's up to date, and he's got three more movies at the very least coming out on Netflix. The rabbit hole's gonna keep growing, but I can tell you, it's not gonna be the Unibowler digging that hole. Somebody out there needs to take up the cause. Keep plaguing your brain. Do it for the greater good of mankind. We're counting on you. Sandler's counting on you. For God's sakes, Rob Schneider is counting on you! Don't let us down! <laughs> I was just watching 50 First Dates, and Dan Aykroyd's character mentions Callahan Auto from Sandusky, Ohio. I'm not sure where this is gonna go, but I feel like I gotta dig into it. I'll catch you on the other side.